I, I remember when I first signed for Man United, Roy Keane was still there, and he would he would scare the life out of me. Like, he he would say he would just say whatever was in his mind, and it could be it would put everybody on the back foot straight away. So you don't even know how to talk to him. Don't even know how to interact with him. He's he was a he. he he would say it as it was, so bluntly and so honestly, yeah, that you just, you'd just you be going, oh, my God, you can't say that. And he would just say it out loud in a changing room full of grown men. He, he would scare me so badly, right? They're just just speaking to him. Hello, hello, Mr. Hello, Mr. Keane. You weren't it, like I that. I swear on my life you're like that. Everybody's hello, like that Mr. with him. Hello, Mr. Keane. He, he would find... I played one game with Roy Keane, right? And it was, a, it was a reserve team game because he was going through the motions of leaving Man United, right? I think they were on pre-season tour and he had fell out with the manager at this point. This is when he went and signed for Celtic. And I played one pre-season game with him, right? And within five minutes of my very ever first, like, reserve team game for Man United, I rolled the ball out to him and because it wasn't rolled at the right speed, he turned round, put his foot on the ball and shouted at me. And I'm this like 22-year-old kid just oh, signed. No. And I'm thinking, ah, oh, no. And he stopped the game to shout at me and I'm thinking, wow, this guy is different. Yeah.